Hi, I'm Chris Wiegand. And I'm Casey Wiegand. I'm a filmmaker. And I'm a wife, mom, and blogger. So I met Casey in 2005. We got engaged in 2006. Married in 2007. Aiden came in 2009. Ainsley in 2010. And Apple in 2012. We spent the last seven years remodeling our last house. We just moved to this new house in a new space, so we have a ton of projects to do. So come along with us as we tackle this project on this episode of Weekends with the Weekends. Hi, my name is Casey Wiegand. Welcome to this episode of Weekends with the Wiegands. We have always wanted a butterfly garden and a vegetable garden. We have this great space in our backyard. It's on the side of our house. It gets lots of sunlight and it'll be the perfect place to build a raised bed. The first thing that we're gonna do is build the boxes out of cedar. We made our boxes eight feet by four feet, and we bought two by eight by eight foot cedar for this. After we build the boxes, we're gonna fill them with garden soil, and then we'll get started planting. Oh, Abby, are you helping now? adding mulch to this in-between area so we don't have to mow. We are getting plants for our garden. You can you buy a tomato plant? You think butterflies will come? Yeah. Getting through. A purple bell pepper. A purple bell pepper. Can you get some strawberries? You got them for me, babe? Thanks. We got strawberries. Look. You want watermelon? Okay, go put that on that part. Say whoops. And there's a key one right here by the study one. Flowers? Yes. For our butterfly garden? Yes. Show me. Say cheese. Are those purple? We need a way to display what kind of uh, vegetables they are. So I took these little cheap pieces of cedar pickets and cut them up. I'm gonna cut these, these little flags that are cheap and go in the ground for steak and stuff. I'm gonna cut those and I'm gonna staple this on the back. And then it'll go in the ground like that. We're labeling these little wooden pieces that Chris made and that way as they grow we'll know what each vegetable and what each flower is. I love rosemary. So good. Yeah, right there. Right here? Yeah, right there. Some friends of ours, we're gonna throw these out. And so we uh, saved them, and we're gonna use them as a little perimeter fence around our garden. Guys, watch your fingers. Okay. Hi, welcome to Weekend of the Weekends. And I caught four snakes. I'm gonna let them go now. <laughs> this one next. Let's let this one go. Use the next one. Bye-bye. I like the idea of being able to teach the kids during this project. They'll get to see the principle of reaping and sowing, and they'll also get to see the value of patience as we wait months for our vegetables to grow. Okay, are ready? Yeah. So, um, we built um, these flower beds, and we write their names, so I would say, um, 
rosemary. Right, Dad, those are rosemary. And squash, the watermelon. I'm right here. That one's watermelon. That's see, it says watermelon. So you know these are watermelon. Enjoy on weekends of the weekend. Bye. Thank you so much for watching today. This is such an easy weekend project that you can do with your family, and it will provide so much fun as we watch our vegetables and our flowers grow.